Hi, welcome to MG Decode videos. Our today's topic is crash consistent backup or application consistent backup, also known as application aware backup. So let's start with crash consistent backups. Crash consistent backup takes snapshot of all the files at the same time using volume shadow copy service. What it really does is that it takes backup from the snapshot. And as a consequence, restores are available for point in time recovery and the restores are more consistent in terms of the versions of the files available. Well, to understand this further again, we will consider this to be a production environment and we are configuring backup for our production environment, which works well. It is all configured and the backup is happening and we realize that there are certain open files. There are files in use, there are interdependencies, and when we are taking the backup, the in-memory files are getting updated regularly, causing different versions of the files to be available, and hence the inconsistency. Well, to avoid all this, VSS comes for the rescue. What VSS does is, it freezes IO, that is input-output operations on the volume, and queues them up while it captures the snapshot. So VSS holds the IO and we capture the snapshot, rather VSS captures the snapshot with a timestamp. Once it has captured the snapshot, it lets the backup to proceed from the snapshot copy. And hence the consistency. What it does is VSS, when it freezes the operation, it captures the blocks in use. And later it tells that information to the backup software and backup software refer to that location and captures all the in-memory information or the IOs happening at that point in time. Hence, you will have a completely consistent backup copies. And so as to speak, if a crash has to happen at that point in time, you will recover a completely consistent backup copy, uh, restore copy out of it. Well, to take it to the next step, let's talk about the application consistent backups. It allows information in memory to be purged and pending IOs to be flushed to the disk. Well, when we, talk, when we spoke about crash consistent backup, there was a bit of a challenge in terms of how to confirm data in memory or pending IO operations, whether those were consistent or not. What I really mean by that, let's just take a step back and see how the transaction gets completed. So uh, let's, see, let's consider we have a SQL database and there are certain updates that needs to be written to our SQL database. So what happens is, first those updates will go on to the transaction log and from the transaction log, those updates uh, reaches to the database. And if any point in time we take a snapshot when all these transactions are in the middle it might cause inconsistent data or incomplete transaction captured in a backup copy. So when we are planning our backup strategy or when we are planning a backup, we have to be conscious of the fact that the transaction should not be incomplete. And how we can do that? Well, VSS comes again for the rescue and it becomes application aware VSS, it could be Microsoft VSS, and in most of the cases is the soft backup software providers VSS. VSS is again, vo a volume shadow copy service. So what it does is, volume shadow copy service ask application to flush the pending IOs so that it can take a VSS snapshot. So let's see it again. So here we have some transactions happening in the memory, are some IOs happening and about to be written to the disk. So what it does is, it let those transaction complete before it takes the snapshot. It connects with the uh, application because it's an application aware, it's a smart VSS we have. So it lets those transactions or, or IOs go ahead and complete and then it flushes the pending IOs or halts them. It questions the next transactions in the proper terms while the snapshot is in progress. And once we have a snapshot taken, boom, it lets all the IOs resume the way it was and let the backup continue from the VSS snapshot taken. And hence it's an application aware backup because it has allowed us to confirm data in memory 
or the pending IOs. So waited for the IOs to either complete, flushes them, uh, made it to the disk, or halts further IOs. Hence, we have an application consistent or application aware backup copy ready. That's all uh, for today. Hope you like the video and you find these videos informative. Please don't forget to subscribe, hit the, hit the like button, and press the bell icon. Thank you for watching.